But the point is to get back on it. Forgive yourself and get back on Evander Holyfield has faced plenty of opponents in the ring, but nothing like this. Together with his friend and financier, Yank Berry, they plan to deliver food aid and help resettle Syrian refugees in a home supplied by Berry's charity. Yank Berry used my likeness to draw the people. I was on my last leg, but this man gave me an opportunity to fight back these people who were taking my memorabilia and all this. He did it himself. I think Evander has come to that realization that he needs to be Evander Holyfield and not necessarily Evander Holyfield, four-time heavyweight champion of the world. If it wasn't for that boys club and other people who had money who sponsored me as a kid, I, w I wouldn't be who I am. The work that I'm doing now with the Global Village, that's what life is really about. I go to heaven, they ain't gonna be asking me how many times you became the heavyweight champ of the world. He gonna ask, what do you do for the people? The reason why you exist in the world is to help somebody, not just for yourself. One of my best friends was Muhammad Ali. Muhammad's health started failing and had to pick a, a new Goodwill ambassador. It was Evander. And yeah, then exactly. Evander brought in Mike. And he brought, you brought him in? Yep. Van Hoyfeld has been very gracious with Mike. Mike bit a portion of his ear off. That takes a lot of compassion. A lot of love in your heart to forgive someone. If you forgive, then you'll have peace. You won't have people fighting each other all the time. That's what make the world go around is people forgive. What did you think when Evander called you and said, I want you to get involved in this project? Well, it's not like I was doing anything, of course, you know. I used to say, <laughs> hey, um, yeah, okay. Well, Mike always talked about that he 